we like good weather, hot and sunny. Mosquito also like good weather. <laughs> However, we don't like to share our life with mosquitoes for two reasons. The first one is that mosquito bites us, which is very unpleasant. But the most important reason is that mosquitoes transmit pathogens. For example, dengue virus, chikungunya virus, which kills many people every year in the world. Actually, there is no effective vaccine to protect people from these pathogens. So one of the ways to protect people is to control mosquito populations. To control mosquito population, we use insecticide treatments. And they work in some cases in the control of uh, vector-borne diseases. However, extensive use of insecticide treatment has led to the selection of resistance. So resistant mosquitoes are now present in the field population, and it is very difficult to kill them. What we know is that resistance affects the biology of mosquitoes. For example, resistant mosquitoes live have a very reduced longevity and lower fertility compared to non-resistant mosquitoes. But what we don't know is the effect of insecticide-resistant genes in the transmission of uh, viruses. So I am Celestine Atiame, and the aim of my project is to know whether insecticide-resistant affect the transmission of viruses by mosquito vectors. The result obtained, sorry, the result obtained in my research will allow developing new tools to control mosquito population. That will also help refining the evaluation of risk of emergence of and spread of virus borne pathogens in human populations. I would like to thank you for your attention. <laughs>